we had this revelation about six weeks ago. You know, the site's going great, 36,000 new customers, we added pro and enterprise, all that stuff's fun. But there was, a, there was kind of a community we couldn't seem to crack and we couldn't, we kept thinking we didn't know why. And so finally we had kind of a big think conversation and we said, you know, where do we really think content's going to be in the next three to five years? Like, who are the people that are going to tell us in the morning, these are the videos to look at, these are the news clips to watch. These are, and we realized that we really actually think that it's very likely that when the smoke clears, that the people that are going to be the guideposts of the future, if you will, are going to be bloggers. And, you know, so we looked at blogs that were using video and we saw a couple that we thought were pretty good, but frankly, they were either mostly just video or just text. So we sat down and we said, let's sit and talk to some bloggers about how they use video and, and images and photos and find out what they could use as a tool that they don't have. And pretty much everybody we talked to said the same thing, which is, I go on YouTube or I go on Medicare Ferry, I go on Blip and I type in what I'm looking for and I find the embed code and I go back to my blog and I paste it in. And then if I need a photograph of, you know, somebody, I have to go to Google Images or Flickr and I type that in and I take that embed code, I have to paste that in. So we're like, wait a minute, we have all those features. Like, that code's built. So my CTO partner in the company, Simon Cavalletto and I sat down and I said, Simon, how long would it take to take these features, video discovery, video embedding, video search, and photo discovery, and build it as, a, as essentially an application for a existing blog platform? And Simon has a long beard, so he stroked his breeze. He said it might take three days. So we called the guys at Six Apart, and we said, you know, we're thinking about building this, this application, and we're thinking we would start with movable type. We're just wondering, you know, do you have something like this in the lab? Are you going to do, I mean, are we wasting our time? And they're like, no, this is great. We have a lot of bloggers who need this. So we're announcing Magnify Publisher, which is a free plugin for movable type. And then we'll, you know, we'll do WordPress and we'll do Blogger and, you know, we'll do Drupal. So, that, you know, we'll do them all. But we just wanted to start with one that we could get right. So a lot of sites um, allow you to post directly to a vlog. Right. Is that true? Yes. Or, and, and so how is your service different? It flips it around the other way. It says, I'm, si I'm si sitting in front of a blog post. I'm ready to start blogging. I want to do something about Hillary Clinton sounding like she's using her southern accent again. But I don't necessarily think that that video is only going to be on YouTube. It may be the longer uncut version is over on Metacafe or Daily Motion. Or, and, and what we believe is that in the future, there's going to be video all over the place and you don't simply want to start with YouTube as the default and presume that they have every video that you'd ever want. 